Hi everyone. Hi there. So we are here today to talk about why would you buy a summer fragrance? Yes. What is the characteristics of a summer fragrance? Yes. Um, what are they all about? You'll probably have seen a lot of the big brands, maybe some of your favourites, launching limited edition fragrances at summertime. Mm -hmm. um, so we thought we'd show you some of them and give you some of the information behind them. Exactly. Except I've got to stop this video right now, Sarah, because you don't look very summery at all you're wearing black uh, i've got my nice orange top on so it just so happens that i have some props here oh gosh oh i know i'm known for props look i have oh, some no. nice hawaiian lays for you thanks i have some nice sunglasses oh, for thanks. you i have some sunglasses for me as well there we go so now i'm feeling much more summery and in the mood <laughs> i, I can't see anything Okay, so the first tip for me is that if you are uh, wearing something, maybe coming out of the winter time, wearing something that's a little bit more heavy, um, as we often tend to do when it's colder outside, something a bit more enveloping, maybe an eau de parfum strength, um, you would buy a summer fragrance because you don't necessarily want to smell so intense in the summer sun. When it's warmer, the sun will heat up those ingredients that are in the perfume and it might become a bit too heady and a bit too overpowering. So you want something lighter and generally this translates to more fruitier ingredients. So for example, Jimmy Choo um, in April launched their um, exotic fragrance. Mm -hmm. And exotic is Jimmy Choo Summer Limited Edition. So in here, rather than really heavy toffee notes, you would get a great bottle look you would get something more fruity like raspberry as well as some pink grapefruit in there. Um, and you can see from the bottle that it's just kind of depicting that lighter juice inside. And I really think this is a great mm, summer cocktail mm. of a scent, this yeah. one. So I would buy this because I maybe don't want to smell as heady or heavy as my normal winter fragrance. Yeah. Um, another real key reason for buying summer fragrance is I know that there's a lot of you out there who love fragrance just for the bottle. <laughs> and sometimes we don't even care how it smells, but the bottles can be so beautiful. Um, and summer fragrance gives you a chance to buy a limited edition bottle. Mm -hmm. So as an example, this is um, Izzy Mayaki summer fragrance for this year. And every year, actually, the smell of the summer fragrance is the same. But what they do is they change up the bottle. Mm -hmm. So this year you can see, here we go, You've got that beautiful golden yellow sun um, on the front of it, which obviously makes us all think of makes summer. Think summer. Um, and I know many people who collect these and have kind of 10 years worth of yeah. these um, in a row on their dressing table. So if you're into bottles and into bottle design, um, this is a great way to add to your collection. Also to note that um, summer fragrances tend to be a lower price point than the original. So for example, with Lode Say, um, the summer fragrance is definitely a few pounds cheaper than buying the original. So if you're wanting to collect bottles, it's quite a good value way um, to do it. Exactly. And third tip, I would say it's great, even if you're staying in the UK, um, as I often do for summer, it's really nice to have a fragrance that makes you think of sipping cocktails on the beach. Definitely, you know? cocktails. Uh, definitely <laughs> a good idea. And what you often find with summer fragrances is their ingredients will make you think of summer sunshine. Mm. So um, Paul Smith, for example, has always done a sunshine limited edition. I've got the men's fragrance here behind me. Um, and this one, he just says, is sunshine in a bottle. And what you get there is you get a sort of lighter, brighter, still with some spicy notes, but actually a little bit of a uh, breezier, spicy yeah. note to it, uh, coriander, for example. Um, and you just get something in here that makes you think of sunshine mm. rather than cold winter nights. So uh, we've said before that fragrance changes your mood. So if you want to be in the mood for some warmer weather, summer fragrance is great for transporting you, even if you don't leave the UK. Yeah. So, excellent price point, lovely bottles, beautiful fresh and fruity um, smells. Just some of the reasons why you might want to um, buy or go and try a summer fragrance. Maybe, you've, maybe you wear Izzy Mayaki all year long and mm. you've never tried the summer fragrance. So go and have a try of it. Um, please let us know how you get on. Is yeah. there any summer fragrances that you really like? Um, click the subscribe button. <laughs> We'd love for you to subscribe to our channel and then you can keep up to date on all our new videos. So, thank you and we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye. 